So how do I add graduation requirements? First of all, they can be added individually. For instance, the honors course of study requires New Testament survey and Old Testament survey as Bible electives. However, let's suppose in your school you require honor students to take four Bible credits. One of them is Life of Christ. AC will take Life of Christ. So in order for him to get credit for that course, we must add Life of Christ to his graduation requirements. To add Life of Christ, I click Add on the top of the academic projection screen. You'll notice that a row appears here in the graduation requirements. I click in the credit field and add one, or you can use the arrows to get one. Click in the subject field. Since I'm adding Life of Christ, I'll just type in L. That makes it easier to find the subject. And once I've selected Life of Christ, click outside the box, you'll see that Life of Christ is added as a graduation requirement for AC. Not only can a graduation requirement be added to an individual, it can also be added to a course of study. If your school requires all students in a certain course of study to take the same subject that is not currently a part of the graduation requirements, that subject can be added to that particular course of study. Now, it's important to remember that a subject must be added to a course of study before that course of study is assigned to a student. Let's take, for example, the college preparatory course of study. The college preparatory course of study, according to the procedures manual, requires two Bible credits. However, students are only required to take New Testament survey, and then they have the option of taking one of several other Bible courses. Let's say your school requires all students in the college preparatory course of study to take Old Testament survey for their second Bible credit. Since Old Testament survey is required for all students in the college preparatory course of study, it will save you time if you add Old Testament survey as a subject to that course of study subject list. Here's how we add a subject to a course of study subject list. Here on the bottom of the course of study screen, you see the subject list. Click New. Highlight the credit and change it to 1. The subject type would be elective, so I type E and select electives. My subject is Old Testament survey. I can either select it from the list or type in the O. And once I've made that selection, I click Save and then click Refresh. By clicking refresh, you make certain the change is updated immediately in the program. When I scroll down in my subject list, you can see that Old Testament survey has now been added as a subject for the college preparatory course of study.